If you are married, then this next interview is for you. If you're not married, then this next interview is still for you because you probably know someone who is married. And maybe they or you need to hear this information. There's a marriage conference coming to town. Zach and his wife Hannah are with the local organizer to find out why this is an event that should be on the definitely need to do this list for local couples. Well, thank you, Mark. The Art of Marriage, presented by Family Life and hosted right here in the Lima area by Faith Baptist Church in Elida and Pastor Tom Cooper, who's joining us now. Pastor, thank you for being with us today. Thank you for having us. An exciting event coming up into this area that a lot of couples, I think, are going to want to know about the Art of Marriage. Give us just a brief overview of this marriage conference that is coming up. It is exciting, Zach. We have uh, a conference that begins on Friday night. It's a video-based conference, so the uh, speakers on the videos are well known mm. and uh, excellent in presenting the material and uh, begins Friday night at 7 o'clock and it finishes right at 9 o'clock and then again on Saturday morning at 9 and it ends at 4 p.m. It is a terrific event. Couples come and they learn about the art mm. of marriage. Well that's a, a good point. I wanted to go to that first. The title itself, The Art of Marriage, because it is an art and, it, and I've seen listed in here it talks about kind of the dance that it is and the art form um, that you have to take on to really have a successful marriage. Sometimes I've said, kind of jokingly, my wife and I have been married for 29 years come uh, this May, mm -hmm. and uh, I love her. I don't want to take anything <laughs> away from that. But if I were to do it all over again, and I certainly would, but uh, standing at that altar this time, mm -hmm. now knowing the complexities of marriage, the challenge of marriage, I'd still have that smile on my face, but maybe not this grin <laughs> yeah, that I sure. had the first time around. Sure. <laughs> yeah. And uh, this art of marriage really is about that, a picture of standing at the altar and you have uh, a new husband and a new wife standing at a canvas and uh, she's holding a brush and he's holding a paintbrush mm -hmm. and uh, together they have to make something, a beautiful piece of art. Mm -hmm. And uh, God gives us the supplies we need he gives us the ingredients or the, the paints and the mm -hmm. colors and the textures and all that we need, the concepts there, but we need to follow his direction and together work and produce that masterpiece that mm -hmm. God wants. Our marriages aren't finished. The masterpiece is right. done. And so we continue to grow, we continue to learn and just celebrate what God has offered us. Yeah. It's uh, very neat to hear about this and to be talking to you beforehand. We spoke of how that this was, um, you kind of did a trial run earlier yeah. this year. What sort of art came out of that trial run? Well, we offered it first uh, just to our church family, uh, a few couples uh, to come, primarily for uh, my wife and I to have the practice of being able to present hmm. this conference. And uh, the four couples that came, it was four or five couples involved, and uh, they all really, from a, and there was a, uh, quite a, uh, a, a good group of people, a difference in a variety in, in the sense of we had people who were just married just a couple of months hmm. to a couple who've been married for, I think it was uh, almost 30 years. Oh, wow. And uh, they all benefited from it and, uh, and expressed that. Some of them were uh, working on some, some struggles and so they came knowing and hoping that this would help. Mm -hmm. And others said, well, I don't really know what I'm getting into, but benefited because it said, things are going great in our marriage, but we wanted to celebrate and just kind of recommit to what God sure. has called us to. So, well, Let's talk about what couples can expect from this. That once they sign, out, sign up, there's a $50 um, sign up fee for both the husband and the yeah. wife, but that includes a workbook right and then there are actually six sessions and you have yeah. one here i do and that fifty dollars is all that's okay, the registration feet. and that's all there is to it there's no more once you arrive yeah and it does include everything except for meals okay. uh, we do provide some wonderful snacks and that sort of thing during the breaks but on saturday there will be a lunch break Okay. And uh, so folks will be able to leave uh, the building and go into town and find uh, a place to have uh, lunch. But the uh, event comes, each person, each couple, uh, the husband and the wife will receive the workbook. And the nice thing about this is it's not a, well, you sit there and listen to a lecture and you mm -hmm. fill in the blanks. It's not that kind of a thing. There's just so many more resources in here. Well, and the workbook itself, I was commenting yeah. beforehand, this is no uh, just 
standard black and white cheap notebook this or workbook this is very well done here they have produced some wonderful materials it has much more information in here than is presented at the workshop yeah. even now i just show you one thing for, uh, to help understand how beneficial this is it's not just a passive experience mm -hmm. actually when they when we're listening to the seminar they actually pause and you stop and it asks you questions the first session is is about just what god's purposes and plan is for marriage and to just give you just an example that our folks would appreciate sure. knowing how the interaction works uh, one of the things uh, with the pause the first one you'd say well what reason what was the reason you got married hmm. and to give some suggestions and and then that session would end up with um, well what are some things that we need to work on and it gives you time right then just to talk about it. Oh yeah. It's it's not like well we get this information and then we go home and hopefully we'll talk about things. Yeah. It's right there at the event. Hmm. That's great. So, so the event does offer a lot of time to talk. If couples are coming in and needing to talk to someone else, is that um, available during the weekend? Um, well, it is available. It's the the event is really not designed for interaction with other couples that sort of thing. But uh, staff, the church. People are there, mm -hmm. are, are willing and, and, uh, and uh, available to have some more personal time. Uh, yeah. yeah, I was telling Hannah beforehand, I thought the neat thing about this um, particular video um, supplement too is that it, it has a, a wide variety of um, well known pastors and people that are, are teachers on there. And it's not just one standard voice you're going to hear. You're going to hear from a lot of different um, people. Absolutely. I shared with the, some of the uh, speakers here. They're listed at the back of this workbook, and they could also go online. Hmm. Folks who are interested in learning more about this could go to our church website and find links there, more information as well as just... FaithBaptistElida.com? Yes. yes, and uh, could go right to artofmarriage.com mm -hmm. and uh, find out all kinds of information. But the speakers are listed. Some well-known people, Vadi Bauckham, a lot of folks are, yeah. are familiar with him, and Brian Carter, and uh, Wayne Grudem, just a whole uh, host of people that contribute to the uh, conference. Hmm. Well, Pastor, we thank you for being on today and letting us know um, about this great event coming up. Well, thank you for having us. Maybe you know someone out there or a couple out there that could benefit. Like you saw on the screen, you can go to faithbaptistelighted.com to find out more information. Registration, register by February 15th. That's $50 a couple. All right, Mark, Jennifer, what a wonderful event. We're going to throw it back to you.